kinds of examples of characters that I like to use from retro pop culture. Uh, and two mainstays really are uh, skeletons and aliens. The reason I like to use them is because I see them as uh, essential metaphors uh, that apply to elements of our life. Um, skeletons, for me, represent not so much uh, the macabre, I mean, you can see it that way, but they basically represent um, the essence of truth, as in stripped down, like bare to the bone. So if you see a, a skeleton represented in one of my works, you can pretty much assume that what I'm talking about is some kind of essential truth relative to the content of the picture. What that truth is, uh, is variable based on your response. So in that sense, it would be true to you. The reason that I like to use aliens sometimes, as in this picture, is because aliens for me represent uh, essential unbridled creativity. Uh, unedited and uncontrolled. I think it's one of the reasons that uh, human beings are so freaked out by aliens is because they don't operate by the same rules that we do. And uh, essentially they have their own world, literally, and so their rules are their rules and we don't understand what their rules are. But what we do understand is that they're completely out of our control. So. Um, if you see them as uh, the essence of, uh, of unedited, un an unedited creative process uh, and as a metaphor for that, then when they're introduced into a picture, uh, that brings meaning into the picture.